We had a great election in 2020, and so far everything's going great in 2022, but there's legislative changes, there'll probably be some more, and I'd like to be at the helm of that. She needs a challenge. She needs someone to say, hey, I'm gonna run against you, not because of who you are, but make this, the process better. And if you wanna make the Republican, Republican Party better, you have to have challengers for each candidate. I think it's time to pass the torch. Uh, you know, six terms already, running for a seventh, uh, a career politician. We need somebody in office that is not a career politician, somebody that has the need to serve the people. If you pull a Democratic ballot, you'll find there are four people vying to be the next Jefferson County clerk. I also asked them why they're running. I'm running because Trump Republicans are attacking our right to vote. And as clerk, I want to make voting easier. More polling locations, free rides to the polls, and early voting. I'm just a regular guy, like I said, who got fed up of sitting on the sideline. And um, I just want to make a difference. And I was just like, you know what, Daniel? Put your helmet on and get in the game. The longtime Republican incumbent uh, has been in office for nearly a quarter century and um, has not been advocating for voter change. And I'm the only Democrat who has experience, who has name recognition. Democratic candidate Tanisha Smith didn't respond to my request for an interview. In Louisville, Rachel Droz, WHAS 11 on your side.